Okay, we're building a quarry. I had it all wrong. So Jess is going to teach me the right way to build a quarry. Alright. Hey guys, this is Jesse. Alright, there's right. nine gear for you. Alright, cool. So that's all that we need. So you kind of see, like, uh, that's how to make that gear. And <coughs> then, um, like, say that we wanted to make a gold one, we would put gold bars where you see, like, the silver or the iron at. Yeah, I had to do that for the quarry. It had diamond gears in it. Oh, uh, yeah, then you you got that part down. Here, take um, that engine. I don't know what use it is to you. Uh, I've already got all the redstone engines. Uh, let's see. So next we need some redstone, I believe. And we need a pick. All right, so let me see if I can uh, get this recipe up. Um, all right, I got it. All right, cool. Um, so what is this you make here? Right now I'm making a pump, and this is just going to pump out all of the oil and then kind of put it where I want it. So do you see it, how, how it's put together? The mining well. Uh -huh, yeah, I see yeah. it. So now we have the mining well there, and then remember those valves that we made? We only need just the one, and that makes a pump. Okay. All right, cool. So now it's going to be night time, so we're going to have to go to sleep for the night. Oh, yeah. Right. Man, I feel like these days just go by so fast. It's a pain in the ass. Man. This is sweet bed, though. We don't have to <laughs> hug each other. Yeah, make sure you sleep on your own side. Alright, so we've got our pump. Um, we need those... Where did I put those guys? Oh, yeah. Over here. Take some of these redstone things. That should be good for right now. And... And then we need some wooden pipes. So, um... Uh, where's my wood? I already got some. Okay. So now for pipes, like each pipe kind of does its own own thing. Uh, um, and like I'll have to explain those later. But right now we're gonna make wooden transport pipes. Are the stone ones not good enough? Wood. Well, uh, yeah, like I said, like they all do different things. Nope. Oh. Like the transport. Pipes are the only ones, like the wooden ones, are the only ones that can pull stuff out of other things. Oh, I and, didn't know that. Yeah, and then like uh, the cobblestone and the normal stone, um, they basically are just like just normal transport pipes. Like they'll just take stuff, but they don't connect to each other. So you can kind of put them next to each other. Otherwise, they will connect and then cause a whole big mess. So that's cool. Next, we need um, some cactus. <laughs> and cactus. yeah, we use it for waterproofing. We have to make uh make it waterproof. So we're gonna come in here and throw it in the furnace. Dude, this this mod is so confusing. Yeah, I know. All right, so basically, you you cook the cactus, and then that makes the dye, and then you just put the dye in your in your like crafting area, just the one stack, and then it just makes a pipe waterproof, and then you just put that in with um your pipe, and then it just makes it a waterproof pipe. That's so cool. let's go out to that oil, just kind of get started a little bit. Um, here I'm gonna grab some like cobblestone really fast. I've got some. All right. Damn it. After I hit the button, I can't <laughs> like walk away from it. I have to hit the tr uh, little pressure pads. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> I've been working on um some sweet like piston doors with fold out stairs in creative. Oh, that'd be sweet. It's a it's a huge design, so you need a fairly large castle <laughs> to put it all in. Alright, um, just toss me your blocks really fast. Just your normal cobblestone. Huh. Alright, um... I think we're right height. No, I need to go one higher.
I saw right. some kid's channel, he'd started like two weeks ago. Same sort of thing we're doing, let's play Tech It. And he had oh, that's cool. 30,000 views. And he Jeez. was just, it wasn't, he had nothing before that. That's crazy. We should invite that kid over here, he's doing something right. Obviously. He had no tags or anything, I don't know why he had so many viewers. And it was in such a short amount of time. Huh. Alright, so we put down the pump. Like this. And then, uh... Let's see... Yeah, we have to power this with some engines. Um... Here, move over. Put that guy there. And then we'll just put one right here. Are these oil wells hard to come by? Yeah, they seem to. Like, you find a lot, like, in the ocean and stuff, but at that point, like, they're kind of, like, not really worth anything to you. Yeah. Just because they're so far away. Oh, is that how you power the redstone engine? With the torch? Yeah, like, they take a second to start up, but then now you see that they're kind of pushing. You said 10 minutes to full efficiency. Yeah, that sounds about right. Alright, so for now, here, move over. <laughs> that looks like a sex machine. Oh, God. <laughs> the way it moves. <laughs> <laughs> Nick would like that. We need him playing this damn game, dude. Dude, I I convinced him to. And he just didn't even didn't even show up. Pretty much. What a kid's dude. a bitch. <laughs> Hopefully he watches this. I uh, he, he usually does. So I hope he hears that and gets upset. Good, he needs to. <laughs> um. Yeah, like, I kind of don't really feel like doing anything too fancy right here. So it's just uh, going to fill that little box up. Yeah, and then oh, we just kind of do it. See how it's starting to fill up, fill up with oil right here? Yeah. I mean, can we pick those up and they'll be full? No. Um, like, say that you've got, like, a pipe like this and you break it. All the oil that's in there, it goes away. Same thing with these tanks, so you can't you can't take it out that way. You can use, like, a bucket and then, like, get one bucket of oil, but that's not what you want to do. Like, we're going to automate this a little bit later on. All right. Well, I'm going to clip so, the video. Okay. Until this is full. All right. Bye. Bye. Okay, so our oil has filled the tanks. And meanwhile, we built some refineries. I found my recipe book. And we are ready for the next stage. Right, Jess? Oh, yeah. Alright, All right, so <clears throat> next what we want to do is, um, let's see here. That's not right. Next what you want to do is, um, you want to have a transport pipe kind of running out um, to, like, pull out the uh, oil. So the, the way that we do, yeah, the way that we do this is um, to pull stuff out. You have to have an engine to pull it out. Every every time you need to do this, though, it's always going to be a redstone engine. That way, you can just have it run all the time. Plus, you can always like flip a switch to turn it off if if we're doing like an advanced sort of build like that. Have so, you just got book it? What's up? Where's it going? It's going nowhere right now. Oh, okay. I thought so we screwed then, it up. Now, so then what we do is we put the um, teleport pipe on it. Now, mm -hmm. if you right click it, you basically. What is hitting you? I'm hungry. Oh. Uh, do you want food? Yeah, sure, if you've got it. Nice. Dude, we, we, we've got more food than I even know what to do with. Oh, I don't want that. Alright. So, let's say for oil, we're going to make it frequency 1. And, um. You see where it says can receive? Yeah. You want that to be false. You want that to be sending out, not um, receiving. Okay. So, so now this teleport pipe is just going off to nowhere. At frequency number one. Yeah. So it's like a channel. Yeah. So next what we want to do... Where do you, you want to set up these uh, refineries? I, I really doesn't matter where. You can go on top of the house if you want. I don't... We'll, we'll, I don't want it. I we, don't want it there. We'll eventually build a room for it. 
Yeah. Um, I kind of like don't want to see it. Well, I think we'll just probably push it over like around like this area because I want it to be like close enough that it'll like all like the trunk will like load every time we get in. All right. What is this? What is this? It's like not centered with a square. Yeah, dude. What? Oh, it's a. F <laughs> I think it's my flail. I was messing around with a flail. Oh. Uh, but I don't know what that's doing there. Huh, that's weird. <laughs> 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 Alright, I guess for now, what we'll do is obviously we're gonna have to like fix all this stuff. Alright, these uh, are the refineries Jesse's putting down. Yep. And they're going to convert right. the oil to fuel. Yeah, we have to run power to them, though. Alright. So basically what we do here is we take um, any, like, normal water uh, waterproof pipe. So for this, we're using cobblestone. So now that you see they're all connected, and then we put the item, or the waterproof uh, transport pipe, and then we set that to frequency 1 and can receive. So now it should start filling up. Yep, there we go. And you see now how the back sides are filling up? Yep. Alright, so now what we need to do is use this for... Uh, we need to power these guys. So let's see here. Um, let's see. How do I... How do I make this? Uh, I can't remember how to make, like, the uh, the power pipes. The which pipes? Um, like the power transfer pipes. So I, I could have sworn all you do is just, uh, yeah, the conductive pipes. Oh, it's got to be stone or gold or wood. That sucks. Stone, gold, or wood. I'll go make some gold ones really quick, because we don't need that many. That is a right. fancy. So on the top of these guys, there we'll put the power. Um, here, get out of my way, dude! <laughs> I'm like trying to place the stuff, and you're like right in front of me. And then we'll convert one of our item teleport pipes to a power teleport pipe. And all right, now so this guy is going to be, say, frequency two. And we're going to set that to can receive true. All right, so cool. So now what we want to do is we've got wooden transport pipes. We need three of these to be waterproof. And then we've got a uh, little bit of cobblestone left. So basically what we need to do here is we need this row to be um, those uh, those like redstone engines, and then below here we need that to be uh, like uh, just normal torches. Okay. So do you want to go make some uh, redstone engines? Yeah. Okay. Redstone engine and torches. Okay, so we're gonna have another recap. We have our power factory providing power to our refinery sufficiently cooled by two water pumps each powered by four redstone engines and we have six combustion engines going each sufficiently cooled like I said which is providing power to our refinery like I said as well nice and quick you see that Ooh. and our tanks are filling up with fuel rather quickly much faster than before when we only had three three combustion engines going and our oil well is still nice and full so it'll be a pain when that runs out but we'll find a new one I guess well thanks to Jesse I've got a better understanding on how all this works and hopefully you do too the recipes in that aren't that difficult I mean the water pump is literally just a pump with some redstone engines going into it the tubing is a little difficult because only some tubing will accept some stuff and that's Jesse's department. But anyway, 
we're well on our way with the fuel we need to power our quarry which will be coming soon just hang in there I know it's been a long time coming but have faith in us anyway we'll be back okay so we're finally to building our building our quarry we're setting it here it's out of the way all that good stuff <clears throat> yeah, I've got more chests on me if we need them. Nah, I got them. We're gonna have to have pipes to these, right? Yeah. Underneath? Hmm? Underneath? No. Um. Yeah, we need some, uh. <sighs> Do you have any iron on you? Two. That'll be fine. I think. It's gonna be a large hole. Yeah. But it would be just big enough for mob spawner, actually. That's good. I think. Nine by nine? Just about. I think it'd be perfect, actually. And it'll go all the way down to bedrock. Yeah. Dude, where would you even find a place to dig 64 by 64? I don't even know, man. People do it, though, dude. Either that or they just build it up in the sky, but I think that's so ugly. Yeah, the... I, I get... See, these huge glass blocks... This, these glass blocks mark 32 by 32. And that's pretty big, dude. Yeah. <sighs> so some redstone engine. This is gonna keep the flow between the chests. Yeah. That way we don't because like if 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 it doesn't have any room to go like anywhere for the items to go to. They just pop out the side and then after a couple minutes they despawn. So we could be like losing like diamonds and stuff. Yeah. Here, let me check it, make sure it works. I think so. All right, so we got the one. Yeah, it's moving around, moving through it. Oh, nice dude, cool. All right. Totally cool. T -t -t totally cool. <laughs> T -t 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 totally cool. Okay, so we got our teleporter pipe from the refinery straight into the quarry to power it. Now I'm gonna do one little thing. I'm gonna only have one. I'm gonna only have two uh, engines running that quarry. I think that should be fine. That's, I think that runs at max speed when it's using fuel. And then that way we'll still have some power going into the uh, uh, refinery. Okay, so our quarry's uh, functioning nice and quick. That cow's made the mistake of jumping in. So it's gonna, uh, we're gonna have to swim. Or get down to bedrock. It's in for the ride of its life, like Jess just said. <laughs> um, Jesse made a good point. The, 
the drill will stop if it hits lava so we have this corner, one cord corner of water going down along with the quarry damn it I shouldn't have jumped in here yeah dude you done goofed uh, along with the quarry that will distinct, uh, extinguish the lava and allow the quarry to keep going and because the quarry is digging deeper the water will flow to every single space despite being one bucket full so that's handy another trick by Jesse I don't know what we'd do without him <laughs> <laughs> so I guess this is it. Oh, dude, look at that sad cow, man. He's just like looking around. He's on. He's on like the only one block. He's looking around. <laughs> dude, these, <laughs> the cows on this world are stupid. Yeah, even like <laughs> you get this one, you get the lava one. I don't know what they're doing. It, it'd be cool if we could get drilled to death. Oh God. <laughs> I'm gonna rain down upon him. The meat of his brothers. <laughs> that is horrible. <laughs> <laughs> what, if he, what if he ate it? Oh god, that'd be terrible. Uh, well, this is pretty impressive. Oh, we just so you know, because I think that you're going to make the mistake one day. Holding shift on this, uh, this orange piece right here, you still fall off. Uh, well, I've made that mistake before. Like I'll be like, oh, it goes so deep, and you just like, fall in. Yeah, I tend to fall into lava a lot because I'm not holding shift. <laughs> but shout out to Rachel because I think she enjoys that. Woo, Rachel, woo. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, dude. So, okay, look, 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 look at how deep it is, like how much we've, we've done so far. Come look at what loot we've gotten. It's all dirt and cobble. It's crap. Oh, nice, dude. Oh, sweet. Oh, oh. Don't you worry, though, because I'm going to build one of my uh, famous disposal units, and all that dirt is going to go straight into that. No, dude. You don't <laughs> do that. Oh, okay. EMC machine, or whatever it was. Yeah, that way we like can use it for like diamonds and stuff instead. Yeah, fancy that. Dirt to diamond. Yep. That'd be a cool business name. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, dude. <laughs> Actually, there's some iron <laughs> under here it's about to get. Nah, just wait until it's done. Uh, the the quarry will pick it up, dude. Yeah, it's about to get it. It's excited. <laughs> I'm about to you drown. Okay. You can watch it, like, come into the chest, too. Dude, this is totally badass. I'm glad you like it. It only took two hours. <laughs> <laughs> we to go from nothing to get to this point. Yeah, but there's no bullshit involved in this one. Only uh, quality production. <laughs> well, I guess this concludes the video. Yep. Farewell, friends. Till next time. Eh. Well, you're <laughs> taking all that shit back to the chest. Alright, I'll do that. Bye bye, everyone. <laughs>